Some people say that your days in school are the happiest days of your life. Here are five people talking about their experiences. Wade Hamlin is a successful self-employed builder. School, it's a waste of time mostly. At least it was for me. I quit after my sophomore year in college because I stopped hoping that I would ever learn anything. I wanted to start earning a living in the real world. The biggest problem with school is the teachers. If I had listened to my teachers, I would know all about Shakespeare and what day the Civil War started and how to conjugate Spanish verbs and how to prove the Pythagorean theorem and all that junk. But I wouldn't know anything about how to make a business deal or raise my kids or anything that's really important. I'm sorry I went to school at all. Anne Marie Johnson is the personnel manager of a department store. I loved school. I was a straight A student almost every year, but I didn't spend all my time studying. I participated in a lot of extracurricular activities and sports too. I was in student government both in high school and in college. I was always sorry when summer vacation started. Three months with no school? Most kids like vacations more than school, but not me. Some of my friends in high school didn't go to college, but they regret it now. Some of them would have done well if they had been encouraged to go. I only regret not going to graduate school after I got my bachelor's degree. I've started an MBA at night, but it's not the same. Work is all right, but I miss the friends and the fun that went along with the studying. Craig Phillips is a Wall Street stockbroker. I went to prep school, and then I went to Harvard. I guess you could say I had the best education money could buy, but it wasn't easy. We had to study very hard, and a lot was expected of us. The thing I remember most is the friendship. The friends I made then are still my friends today. Most of us were together in prep school, and then at Harvard, too. Sports were very important for me. I believe that team sports teach people to work together, and competition with another team brings out the best in people. Anyway, discipline was stricter then. It's too bad that it's changed. Maybe young people would be better behaved nowadays if there was more discipline in the schools. My biggest regret is that I didn't have the family life other boys had. After age 12, I only saw my family at Christmas and in the summer. Colleen McGrath is a factory worker. School was just another part of neighborhood life. My brothers and sisters and I went to a parochial elementary school three blocks from home. Later, we had to take a bus to the public high school, but it was only a 10-minute ride. And then we all went to the local community college. I wish my kids could do that. I have to take the youngest in the car to the big elementary school across the river. A school bus picks up the other two who are in junior high school, and it takes them almost an hour each way. I wish things hadn't changed so much.